swear I always have bits of hair that fall out like they're the same length as my normal hair just never stays in it's so annoying who watched the one love Manchester concert last night oh my goodness it was so good like I definitely had a cry as I'm sure a lot of people did it was amazing so amazing of um, Ariana Grande and everyone that obviously like took part and stuff they did that in two weeks so good concerts like that can take months and months to plan and they did it in two weeks so i've also ordered the jumper that she was wearing there's loads of like merch and stuff so i've ordered the jumper she was wearing because i'm a sucker for a sweatshirt sucker for a sweatshirt and i've ordered it in a medium because i love an oversized sweatshirt but yeah it was only 24 pounds i think you obviously have delivery and stuff but all for a good cause so that is what i've done the vlog did go up yesterday but I didn't shout about it just because it really didn't feel right after what happened Saturday night in London. I know loads of, like, a few people in that area as well, so that was quite a tense night for me. <laughs> uh, I was watching until about 2am and then turned everything off and went to sleep once I, I'd heard back from everyone that I'd text. I, whenever this sort of thing happens now, I literally don't know what to say. There's nothing else that I can say, anything anyone can say. Like, it doesn't make anything easier or anything better, so. But yeah, I had a bit of, um... I had a bit of a social media silence until the evening when everything started with the concert and stuff. I just felt, I didn't really have anything to say and I didn't want to say anything just for the sake of saying something, so I just didn't. So I had a social media blackout for most of the day. Like I said, the vlog did go up, but I just didn't like share it on anything, so I'm going to do all of that today. When I get home from work, I'll do all of that. I hope you all, my ear is so red. What does an itchy ear mean? Like a burning ear, what does that mean? Does that mean someone's talking about you? Whoever's talking about me, please stop because you're making my ears itch. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you all had a good weekend anyway. Um, or as good as it could be and hugged everyone that you loved and told everyone you love that you love them. I tweeted on Saturday night, I was like, I literally just want to wrap everyone that I love in bubble wrap and hold them tight and not let them go because it's just so scary. The world we live in right now is so scary. It's obviously much later right now. And why is it when I'm trying to eat healthy? Mum walks in with this, a bag of sweets from like Mr. Sims, the old sweet shop. Like a proper little pick and mix packet. I'm gonna be good though and I'm not gonna eat it. I'm gonna be good. I ate all the sweets. I am ashamed. <laughs> Apparently it is meant to be horrible and rainy and windy today. So I've got on my little leather jacket. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this. Focus on the leather jacket. It's just like a really cute cropped jacket. I absolutely love this. This was my bargain from ASOS Marketplace. Like it should have been £207 and I paid 60 I love it. It's so cute. Like it's lined just inside. Cropped so cute i think it's really flattering as well it cuts me off like just at the right place so the only thing is it's a bit of a squeaky leather jacket <laughs> but yeah it's meant to be a bit colder today so i was like i don't want to take a scarf because it's june hi but i don't want to not have anything on my neck and it's meant to rain so i need to take an umbrella actually mm. i just have coca pops i like coca pops they just get stuck in my teeth so windy today and it was yesterday too i don't know why i made that face and said it like that but i did i did it literally rained all day yesterday didn't stop did not stop it was wonderful where has summer gone people like i was just getting used to this warm weather and now it's not it's horrible so windy i've forgotten my shop keys i changed my bag because i'm taking some stuff back to zara and their bags are crap if it rains so i've like bought a bigger bag with me and put like the Zara bag in that bag, does that make sense? And I took everything out of my other bag except my shop keys, so hopefully Hannah has hers, otherwise we ain't getting into the shop. I look so rough today. What is with these bags? I had so much sleep last night, it's unreal. That's a bit better. I'm going to Zara to go and return the stuff that I got. I hate going to Zara to return stuff because they're always so moody in there and it's always, always like you've just asked them to like wipe your butt when you go in there and they're like, can I have a refund? <laughs> um, so yeah, that's exciting. And then I'm gonna go buy some lunch. I think I'm gonna get a baguette from Pret because Hannah mentioned it earlier and now I really want one. I look rough. <laughs> 
I feel horrible. We did a window change, and after we do a window change, I always feel like really, I don't know how, like dusty. I don't know. I just feel horrible. So I went into Lush after work and got a um, bubble bar, the bright side. I'm gonna have a proper soak in the bath tonight. I've decided, and also my skin has been really bad recently. Like for some reason it's gone quite oily i don't know why and i've kind of broken out around my chin and my nose like my makeup just does it down my nose so i picked up another number seven hot cloth cleanser because i used to swear by that stuff um and i used it all the time i've bought it loads and loads of times before and i stopped choosing it well i don't even know what i replaced it with i don't know but i stopped choosing it i started choosing like loads of other stuff and nothing seems to be doing anything at the moment so I decided to try that again because it's never failed me before and if that fails then I need help <laughs> but yeah I picked that up it's only £10 and it's literally pretty much a dupe for the um, Lizelle hot cloth cleanser so I am going to go home have a hot bath with bubbles and watch Pretty Little Lies in the bath because it's Wednesday so Pretty Little Lies day and yeah I'm really tired today and it's ridiculous because I literally fell asleep I think at like half nine last night really early and slept through so I don't know why I'm tired but I'm really tired today something I really love doing on a Friday morning is sitting in traffic it's quarter past nine I've only just got to the park and ride this is ridiculous um yeah brilliant although I did drive past uh, a crash so I don't know if it was that or what no, no one was injured it was fine it was just the cars were injured that was it by the looks of things yay I haven't had breakfast yet today either so I was really hoping I'd be able to get here early and get some breakfast but that hasn't happened I look bald because my hair is up oh I've got to wait for my next bus as well I feel like most of this vlog has been sat in this car in this car park because nothing else has happened I didn't vlog yesterday I was in a really weird mood yesterday I went and voted in the morning and then mum wanted to go out for lunch but you know I just I just couldn't be bo <laughs> that sounds so bad but I was like I was in one of those moods where I couldn't be bothered to talk to anybody and make like small talk and make an effort so I didn't um, I had an afternoon nap I watched some Netflix and I tidied my room and I just kept myself to myself and I was in bed at half nine that was how my Thursday went. I just, yeah, I don't know. There's no reason for it though. I'm not due on or anything like that. So normally I get a bit like that, like a few days before I'm due on my period, but I'm not due on for like another two weeks, three weeks. Is that TMI? Probably, but yeah. So there was no reason for my mood yesterday, but I was in a bad one. I better go get a bus ticket and tell Hannah that I am on my way into work. <laughs> Guys, I honestly think I'm going to end up going to this wedding like in my underwear because I've ordered two dresses and a pair of shoes from ASOS. It was meant to come today. It hasn't turned up. So I'm like, oh, I leave on Thursday. I have nothing, like nothing to wear. I can't leave work over the weekend because I'm the only key holder. So I can't leave. I have to stay in the shop. I've got a rosy red nose because I'm making myself on my face. I've got spots. <sighs> What? I have nothing to wear. I really hope it comes tomorrow. Who delivers ASOS? Is it Royal Mail? I think it's Royal Mail, isn't it? I might be wrong. But whatever, they haven't delivered my parcel and it was meant to come today. The sun is very bright. I'm not moaning about that. I like the sun. But yeah, I don't know. I don't really know what to do. I was hoping I was going to be able to show you them and then you could help me choose between which one to wear. But... I don't think that's going to happen. I really hope they come tomorrow. They're both Chi Chi London dresses from ASOS. One of them was in the sale, one of them wasn't. And a pair of shoes that were in the sale. I love the shoes so much. Fly. But yeah, and I've got another jumpsuit coming on Monday from... Hopefully Monday. From Warehouse. So I was hoping I'd be able to show you the dresses today. So you could tell me what you thought of them on Sunday. And then... No. and I've picked all my nails off and they're starting to break so I'm going to put I'm going to put some more gel on them but just like the clear on top so they don't break so I can then do them for the wedding on Thursday night because me and Chris are going up I keep scratching my neck um, me and Chris are going up Thursday because he's got the stag do on Thursday night 
and then the wedding's on the Friday. So I'm going to be all alone in the hotel on Thursday night with nothing to do. So I think I'll probably end up starting to edit the vlog and stuff and just have a bit of a pamper. I might take some of my Lush bath bomb with me, use that, have a bath if there's a bath in the hotel room. Um, do my nails and stuff, maybe do like a hair mask and then and stuff. But yeah, right now I'm going naked. Going naked to the wedding. There is hope that I won't be going to this wedding naked. I've just received an email to say they're going to attempt delivery again. Apparently they d like attempted to do it yesterday, but we had no note or nothing. So, and someone was in the house all day. So that's sort of rubbish. But they're going to attempt apparently to do it again today. So, there is hope. Oh, I felt a bit like the grudge just then. Oh, no. Um. <laughs> um. So yeah, they should arrive today now so hopefully you will see them and you can tell me what you think and i'll show you the shoes because i absolutely love the shoes but right now i'm having breakfast and i ran out of cocoa pops yesterday so i've got to have something boring so i think i'm gonna have cornflakes boring as much as i'm not a fan of rain and i'm not although i love like laying in bed or like sitting in watching a film when you can hear like really heavy rain outside i really like that i think that's really like comforting and cozy but i hate going out in rain who doesn't? Um, but the smell of summer rain is probably one of my favourite smells. Like walking out of the door and just smelling fresh summer rain. I really like that smell. Does anyone else like that smell? I think it's one of my favourites. Can you get candles in that scent? Is that weird? They've arrived. Mum texted me. She was like, you've got two parcels. Um, and I was like, oh, are they both ASOS? She was like, yeah, one, one was Royal Mail. The other one came Courier. It's really random. They used to make two different. She was like, do you want me to open them? I was like, you're so nosy. But yes, open them. And she sent me some pictures. I'll show you the picture of the shoes. Oh my goodness, I'm in love. Obviously, you'll see them in real life later. Look, they're so cute. I don't even know if you can hear me right now. I'm going to sneeze. Um, yeah, focus. Thank you. Obviously, I will show you them on later. But I'm so excited. Also, yeah, as I was saying, I don't know if you can hear me because the microwave was going. I've got rice for dinner, dinner, lunch, and I bought a bag of giant chocolate buttons yesterday and didn't eat them because we got donuts. So I had a donut instead. So I'm going to eat my giant chocolate buttons today. Win win. I just washed up. I think the water was a bit hot. <laughs> My hair's so red, you can't even see like how red it is. Ouchie. Whoops. So, I have just got home from work and no one is home. And I don't have a house key because I used a spare key this morning and posted it back through the letterbox because I didn't know where mine was and I didn't know no one was going to be home. So, I can't get in the house. Good job it's a nice day. Um not quite sure what to do success my dad has a spare key <laughs> so i'm gonna walk around and get it he literally lives like around the corner i can see his house from um our bed my bedroom so let's go get a key so i can get in i called him he was probably like why is my why is she calling me on a saturday night she doesn't call me on a saturday night like, what's happened <laughs> let's go get a key got my key it's actually like nearly nine o'clock now um i stayed for a cup of tea and a chat because i haven't seen him for ages so it was nice to catch up and now i'm just gonna go home get in the house try on my dresses find some dinner because i haven't had any dinner yet just a cup of tea and then edit the vlog which hopefully won't take me that long i'm really hoping it won't take me ages um literally this is how close i live to my dad though by the way where i was just walking was like two seconds from his house and I'll show you when we get to like my back garden it's so close um but yeah I'm hoping the edit won't take too long so yeah <sighs> this wasn't my plan for this evening I had my evening planned and now I don't even know what to have for dinner either I'm gonna have to look in the freezer try and find something right here you go this is my back garden all of this hedge the hedge is all up there it's all my garden Yep, that close. 
I just got in my room and look, she's hung them all up so you can kind of see them. So this is a navy blue one. I absolutely love, oh, okay, cool. I love this one. It's so cute. I feel like, I love this. It's so cute. That's the back. I feel like I need a strapless bra with it, but that's all right. How cute is that? So pretty. Then there's this one which is really cute as well. The back's more like that. Really sweet. Not sure if the pink will suit me though. And then this is the warehouse jumpsuit, which I am in love with. Like, I might even just keep this anyway, if I pick, the like, one of the dresses. But let's try them on, because my battery is going to die. Oh, I need to show you the shoes. Where are the shoes? <gasps> I'm so excited for the shoes. Shoes! Oh, yes. How beautiful. They are amazing. They're very high. Oh dear. <laughs> Just walked back round to the hall to uh, take my shoes off and notice that we have a new pet. What the hell? Lovely. Just what I wanted in my house. Okay, <laughs> jumpsuit on. Really nice. Probably a little bit too long, like I'd prefer it if it was like up here. Um, just one main issue. I can't do it up. Um, my boobs are too big for it. It's so annoying. I really hope it's not going to be the case for these. It's so nice though, isn't it lovely? And it has pockets. We all know how much I love pockets. But this is a no because I can't do it up. Oh dear. On to the next one. Okay, dress number two. I can do it up, so good start. How adorable is this? I feel very poofy though. I feel like it might be a bit extravagant maybe for the wedding. Although to be fair, I'm usually the one that's a bit overdressed anyway. So I feel like I could get away with it. But oh my goodness, my waist looks so tiny. Oh my goodness, I do really like this one. But I don't know if it's a bit too much. Hmm. I like the back. It's quite flattering. I love it. It's so nice. I'm so glad I could do it up as well. I was like, can I, can I? Yes, I can. There's a tag in there, I can feel it. This is really sweet though. The annoying thing is though, guys, this is, no, that's the dress that is in the sale. This one was full price. Ah, oh, maybe. It is cute. I just don't know if it's a bit too poofy. Possibly. Let's get the next one. Okay, dress number three fits perfectly. Definitely need a strapless bra though because you can see it at the back. Can you see that? I have no idea. Um, if I feel big, there's more room in this. I feel a bit bigger in it, which is weird because it's a darker colour. I thought I'd feel a bit smaller, but I love the like the skirt of it. It's so pretty. I just feel a bit like bigger in it. Is that weird? Like I feel like my boobs are bigger in this. Hmm. Don't know. Maybe I could go braless in this. That would be nice. <laughs> I do really like this one. I'm gonna have to ask my mum's opinion and your opinion. Which one do you like best out of this one and the pink one? Which one do you like best? I need to show you the shoes. Guys, these shoes are insanely high. I just put them on a minute ago and I was like, um, I may need to get flats as well. Look at this dress. It's really cute. Is it a bit puffy? Oh, I don't know. I prefer the sleeves on this. I don't like my arms, as you guys know, if you've watched the vlogs for a while. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to have to ask my mama. Hang on, let me get the shoes. Okay, I'm going to zoom in a bit. I'm really sorry about my feet, if you don't like feet. But seriously, also, don't mind my bruise. How amazing are these freaking shoes? They're beautiful. They are so so high though, it is unreal. They're actually quite comfy for the height. I don't know if I'm gonna last all day in them though. But this is with the blue dress with them. Excuse my slippers. But yeah, I think that the shoes work really well. They kind of make it look like it's a bit shorter than it is. It's kind of a funny length. But I think the shoes help. Do we think? I mean, seriously, I'm in love with these shoes. I will just say, though, they're really hard to walk in on wooden floor. Like, I feel like I slip and slide a bit. A little bit. 
but it's much easier to walk in them on carpet like I can proper walk in them on carpet which is fine oh my goodness they're amazing oh washing <laughs> they're so nice surprisingly comfortable although I have two ginormous blisters on my on my ankles right now like on my tendon from my trainers because I was an idiot and wore like those foot condom socks rather than proper trainer socks and now uh, they are huge like the worst blisters I've ever had like even through my dance past these are the worst blisters I've ever had so and these shoes kind of like rub right on the back of them so Hopefully they'll have healed a bit by Friday because otherwise it's going to be even more painful than it already is. But yeah. I need your help guys. This dress or the pink dress? This blue dress or the pink dress? Which one do we think? Because I can't even do this up so that's not going to happen is it? I'm leaving it up to you. Let's call the pink dress dress number one, the blue dress dress number two. So leave it in the comments, one or two. Which do you think? I need your help. It has to be one of them because I haven't got time to go and get anything else. <laughs> right, I now need to start ed editing this, find some food, um, charge my battery ready to start next week's vlog tomorrow um, and get out of this. And I'm going to put my pyjamas on because why not? It's like ten past nine now. I think that deserves pyjamas. So I'm going to end the vlog here. So I really hope you enjoyed the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. If you watched all the way to the end, I'll know if you have because you'll comment about the dress, won't you? You'll help me out. So leave me a comment down below. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed, subscribe so you don't miss another weekly vlog. Every Sunday, 12pm, a weekly vlog. And I'll see you next week. I love you.